beginning of the video, you'll see how the Striter system is working together with Thermopulse. In an earlier development phase, where the system is currently being tested and fine-tuned, the goal of this test is to verify the heat transfer, efficiency, and stability of the system under real operating conditions. The setup is open, so that you can see the entire heat transfer process. You can see the Striker turbine, the 960-liter tank, and the measuring instruments that precisely monitor temperature, pressure, and flow rate. During the test, the primary circuit cools down from 150 degrees Celsius to 80 degrees Celsius, while the heat is transferred via the heat exchanger into the secondary tank. This tank has a volume of 960 liters, and its temperature increases by 3.7 degrees Celsius per minute. The measurements are taken in real time and recorded directly on the PLC display. Specifically, in this test, the system transfers more than 240 kilowatts of thermal power, while the electric power input of the motor is about 36 kilowatts, resulting in an instantaneous COP of about 6.9. The Striker technology uses hydrodynamic cavitation, a process in which micro-implosions with high energy density occur in the liquid. This energy is directly converted into heat without combustion and without emissions. The entire system operates in a so-called TikTok mode, where the tanks alternately heat up and discharge, ensuring a continuous and stable energy output. This test clearly demonstrates that the cooperation of the Striker and Thermopulse systems represents a functional and efficient technological solution, capable of generating a large amount of heat directly from the energy of water. These results confirm the system's high energy efficiency and open up new possibilities for industrial and ecological applications.